Hello everybody, this is Jack and let me know if you hear me well. I have prepared a nice Google business profile presentation and some other parts of it. Not really going to share it, what you're going to get and what you're going to see, but it's exciting to me. So today's topic is about Google Business Profile. Google Business Profile listing is for each business crucial. It's actually critical for any local business. Google will probably list your business even if you haven't do anything, but it will show as not verified. And because it is not verified and it has not the uploaded elements, it will not rank high. But if somebody really specific looking for your business, it will show. To get the most out of Google My Business Profile is important to stay up to date with the newest development for Google Business Profile. That is kind of what I do not like from Google. I love Google. I understand it. It's logic, but always changing. Ah. Therefore, we make an overview of what we think has changed. Every business owner should be aware of it. Yeah, yes. I, I, uh, the principle stays the same, but if now, Google Ads, they do it kind of gradually. But Google Maps, Google My Business, Google Business Profile, and probably probably 10 other names they came up with. Now, now this last two years is Google Business Profile. And hopefully, they will not change too much anymore. And... Actually, it is very important. Everybody use nowadays their mobile phone and look for a certain business on their mobile phone. And if you don't show, if your Google, if your business listing is not showing on a on a mobile phone, then it's not likely they're going to use you, and they go to a competitor. So that's, we make an overview of what we think to change, which every business owner should be aware of. So here is an overview of the different changes Google Business Profile we are going to discuss. So option to add health and safety attributes. That is kind of a left over, or they say is, the, I'm not sure you left over, it's the right word, but, but created in, in the COVID period. COVID related attributes for business in the food industry and restaurants. Yes, COVID has changed a lot in Google business listing. Attribute for online service, it is new. So Google tries to get a stake of the online business. They, they're coming over with a store and online store as part of the Google business profile. Google, the, you, you can see the call history. So they, want to make sure they want to show how good the Google Business Profile listing is and that you value them. And I have the feeling at some point they're going to charge for it. But yeah, I'd rather charge for it than, they, than you don't get business from it. And you get other Google Business Profile inside data on the, on the dashboard. And Google Business Messaging is that good or bad? New review removal management tool. Google Business is showing a label for new reviews. Yes. They are really, they kind of want to make the review section as an, an social posting section so that you can respond to the reviews. And Google is taking action to highlight woman-led, black-owned, Asian-owned, and friendly businesses. 
So Google reduce Mac video upload size. Yes, they do, of course. Google guarantee service can batch. Yes, that is something what every business, if you qualify, should do. But as marketer, there's not so much money to make because there's a lot of administration what the business needs to provide to Google and you don't have that information. So there's not so much that you can do because all the information they have to provide comes from the business. And phone names aren't allowed in Google posts. The biggest change in 2021, 22, Google Business Profile changed its name to Google Business Profile. What does that mean? As a business, you need to be where you are, customers are. So, that is kind of, that is, that is, that is where we always want to realize. As a business, you need to be where your customers are. What does that mean? How many people will use online use Google? Probably 90%, correct? So there is no, there is no, no not using Google is not an option. We just, it's just a given. Although there are many online local directories like Bing Map and Apple Map and Google Business Profile is the most popular responsible for driving traffic. 80% of local target traffic to neighborhood business, 80%. So a lot of people, when they look for a specific business, they look in the map sanction. What does that mean? If you can help a business owner list in that top map section, they will see incredible results. Now, People always say it's free traffic. In, in, in principle, it is free. You do not pay for the click, at least not always. I probably will show you uh, something else. <laughs> yeah, I didn't prepare that, but I will try to show it to you. I will tell already. So Google shows three to four listings on the first page of Google. And what they did is, what they did is, the first listing in the map section is now de determined by Google Ads. So you can create a Google Ads campaign and target the target that the ad, the listing, the business listing, is shown in the top of. Google Business. I probably should do a training uh, separate on that. I will do that uh, as a part of Google Ads training probably, but that is really powerful. That will change again. 150% uh, road in search volume without the, without the qualified near me. Wow. So they, they see continuous growth to use the Google Maps action. Five hundred percent increase in the near me mobile searches. 500%. 300% increase in open now. So they're looking, and actually I do too. You guys do that too. If to check if a business is open, I'm not only using the map section to find the business, I actually, if I need if I need to know when does the business close, I actually I actually look at the business hours. I do that on a regular basis because I'm always end of the day thing. And three and four smartphone owners turn to search first to address their immediate needs. Immediate needs, and that is the crucial thing when you, you do Facebook. And even YouTube, but it's, it's not so much as Facebook, but Facebook is really interruption marketing. So you just on Facebook hanging out and at all of a sudden they show an ad will touch your interest. So that's in, you were not looking for, 
that serves that plumber they just know facebook knows everything from you they collect all that information they don't care about privacy and they show related ads so it's a good and a bad thing but they do you can you can like it or not like it but they know they know all that they track you the whole day and they know exactly where you're interested in and if you were interested in toilet paper they show toilet paper ads for example i'm just giving a stupid example so but that is interruption marketing but google they is more immediate needs when but they show ads related to your search term they you probably will and store online store and they they kind of also know that you are interested in toilet paper so they show all on stores which have toilet paper but that is immediate needs ranking in google maps is important because business get found in google what is crucial to any business a google business listing increased trust to contact the business yes if somebody is has heard about your business they're going to look you up at least the first time before you visit if they cannot find you in the map section you haven't increased the trust if they think uh, i don't think you exist you're not in that map section Ranking Google is a part because get found on Google, increase your trust, and able to show customer reviews, increase the trust in your company. And that is the crucial part. So first you need to get found. You have to have a listing. But nowadays, reviews are crucial to gain the trust that they call a visit the business. Reviews is important. So ranking in the top three in Google Maps leads to more phone calls, more clicks to the website, which can do the conversion, and this is my offer. Okay, here I switch a little bit. So when you speak with a business owner you kind of want to tell them why they need a google business listing correct and that is your offer you increase phone calls and increase website visits and then you kind of want to link them relate them what that does for that business and depending what it does for your business that determines how much you're going to ask for the service google business profile will increase sales with this knowledge how are you going to pitch google business profile so wolf you guys have a headset i kind of kind of want to do one role play tonight wolf you guys have a headset so we can do a role play I'm better to speak to person than to my monitor. Who wants to get trained to do a phone call with a prospect for Google? Gears, you want? Let's see if Gears. Yes. Okay. Very good. All what you say, yes. I will try to uh, Gears, do you have a headset? I try to unmute you and a mute request. So Gears, I have sent an unmute request. Ha, Gary, do you uh, hear me? Yes, I can. How you can? Hear okay, me? okay, okay. Thanks for coming uh, online kind of thing I, I, so, I guess I get the best education when we go on one on one yeah you get the premium seat yes <laughs> how are you okay 
hanging in there. Okay, so do you want to be the client or do you want to be the marketer? Uh, so the, the pitch is to get a Google business profile client. I want to be the market. Uh, I want to be the client. Okay. So. Okay. So I will call you. So let's do a really cold call. A really cold call. I love it. So let me try it today. Uh, so I called you. Okay. Hello. Hello. Who's speaking? Girish Patel. Hi, Girish. This is Jack. I, I sent you an email the other day. I'm not sure if you saw it, but I found your business uh, not on the first page of Google. So I was just wondering if you were aware of it. Yes, I'm aware of it. But the problem is that there's so many changes going on with Google that every time I try to, you know, fulfill the requirements for Google so that I could get listed higher up in Google, they keep changing. Yeah, I, you know, I know. So, it's, so uh, I don't know which not, way to go. Are you not frustrated that your competitors yes. are listed ab above you? Yes. And some of them I've been to their place and they list high, higher than the business, what they're doing in the business. So that I don't understand. So let me introduce a little bit. Uh, my name is Jack and I have an uh, agency service helping local business like you to get uh, listed higher than the competitors in Google. Do you want uh, me to help you? Yes, definitely. So I saw you're not listed on the first page of Google. You are kind of have a listing, but only on page so, two or three, uh, depending on the keyword, what you type in Google. Yeah. So I, so if I can increase, so I, in your niche, I'm pretty familiar with, if I can increase one customer per day, you know, I really, I really want not to overpromise one more customer per day. So 20 more customers per month. What would that do for your business? 20 customers a month that yeah. would be great because i my my industry that i'm catering to is small businesses that don't have any web presence so i want to reach out to them and and see what i can offer them or that will make them stand out but i need to be up there to prove that i am the guy to reach so if i'm not on page one how am i going to convince them that they're not on page one yeah yeah Actually, you hit the nail. I, I, I love you. So, if you had 20 more customers, how much money would you make? Let's see. I'll tell you right now. Oh, I'd make $6,000 a month. That's a good starting point for me. Yeah, six thousand dollar a month. So normally, I, when I help local business like yours, I charge thousand dollar. But you know, I know you're struggling. You you haven't had ranked high, and I wanted to help you badly. I willing to do it for five hundred dollar. How does that sound? Five hundred dollars. A month. Oh yes, I would jump on that today. Okay, and which card do you want to use? Visa. Okay, oh, you kind of make me a little bit too easy, but I, I know go I'm going to go back and uh, okay for five hundred dollars. What am I going to get, Jack, Mr. Hoffman? So, I went to your listing. We can optimize it. We can have your business listing all over the internet. And the goal is that your business listing is above your competitors. It takes a little bit of time, typically three months, but we will get there. Okay. That Good. sounds reasonable. Okay. Uh, which card do you want to use? 
I have one other question. Okay. I also see on when you go into, you know, on Google, whether you're using the smartphone or the most probably on the smartphone, you see these businesses that are in the three pack. Is that also another game created by Google or is it something related to special setups that they have that make them do that or you know because i want to make sure that i'm there as number one no matter what down the road you know i want to gain my gain my presence on the internet for my my business and want to be known in the area as the the go-to guy for providing small businesses ways of growing their business so what we're going to do is we're going to improve your Google My Business profile. We're going to rank you higher. We're going to target keywords and your ranking will increase. Goal is to, to help you with 20 new clients uh, a month. But okay. we cannot guarantee a specific position. Okay. Because that, that depends on a lot of things. So once you really make some money, like $6,000 six, six per month, what we can do is is that we go we we pay google a little bit of money to list you on the first page of google then it is guaranteed but we're not starting with it. there's no need for it okay one yeah but i understand if, if if that is something you want we have we, we i can help you okay yes because the thing is i've been trying on my own trying to do this and every time i turn around there's a change oh google is changing this I said, you can't win with Google. What is it? Am I supposed to be paying them money to rank me? Or are they, am I going to be able to do something to rank myself? So I got caught in a nut to a shelf. And that's why I came on today's program. When, you see, when I seen Google Business Profile, I said, I need to attend this webinar because I hope he has a role pay and I'll be the first one <laughs> to be on that. <laughs> Uh, you volunteered for it. You did well. Huh? Yeah. You... Okay. So how did how did you feel that the conversation went with I me? think the first time when you said easy, I should have gone more in depth. And now I got in the information that what you said is when you're starting off initially, there is no guarantee. It takes a while to build a profile and to get it up there. Down the road, once you get the customers and you do get the 20 customers that you know that I'm going to be paying you for, you know, in that ballpark, I can increase my budgeting on saying, okay, what's the next step to be ranking on Google on the first page? And you pretty much gave me the direction. And yeah. yes, we have to pay Google. That's what I said in my text. I think I wrote to you there on the on the on one of my text lines. I wrote there. I said, so Google. Okay, what did you say? So it's called the dollar dollar for them. Yeah, yeah. Because that's but, what it is. Every time that, yeah. I think they start realizing that people are getting the grasp of ranking on Google, then they got to add some twist in it to get something out of it. You know what I'm saying? Correct. So that is that's always my plan B. If the customer is not happy, we can mm -hmm. always go for paid traffic. Oh, okay. Yeah, so that's then we can guarantee but google business profit is more seo you can optimize things but there's no guarantee see the 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 thing here mr hopman is being a newcomer in the thing it is going to be difficult on how you do like you say i'm speaking you're listening right you're not saying you. anything because you're listening to what i'm saying and you pinpointing what i want so you Correct. pitch an offer and I say yes. And then you agree. If I give you this amount, are you willing to sign? And I said, yeah, you got, you got it. An offer, an offer and, that I can. And if you do use. this, if you do yeah. this, you get the credit card. Yeah. Yep. It worked for me all the time. And then the other option you said, like plan B is if you really want to start on that point is paid ads which will get you faster faster into the higher in the Google rankings. Because yeah. once you start paying Google, then they're going to rank you, obviously. Correct. It's good I got on this call with you. Good. Thank you. Thanks for coming on call. So we have three other ones which we can do. 
So okay. thanks for coming on and uh, do the role play with me. Okay, no problem. Thank you. Bye. What do you guys think? How how was this? You you feel that helped you? Good. Uh, let's see. I kind of I'm in the mood to do a couple of more. <laughs> Daniel, do you want the uh, the next one? Let's see if I can uh, get you. You should get an unmute request now from Go to Webinar. Hi, Daniel. Do you hear me? Yeah. Can you hear me, Jack? Yes. How are you? Doing well. What do you want to be the the client, or do you want to be the marketer? Oh, I'll I'll try the client. Okay, so I make it me difficult. I call you. Okay, yep. I'm not sending an easy email, and you have a link. Now I call you. All right. Okay. Uh, hello. Uh, yeah, uh, it's a pizza shop. Hi, with do with who I'm speaking? Yeah, this is Dan. I'm the owner. Okay. Hi, Dan. I know you're busy, so I'm not going to waste your time. You probably have some customer in the line, correct? Oh yeah, always always busy on a Tuesday night here. Okay, okay. So out of times you are not busy? Yeah, but it's kind of unpredictable, you know? Okay. So I I have a digital agency and I help pizzerias like you to get more traffic from Google. Google has also an online store in the business listing. Would you like to hear more about it? Yeah, it's it's okay right now. Yeah, let's let's do it. So Google really hates Amazon and oh. <laughs> they have no new model in it. It's the online store and they, they do a lot of restaurants and I study in it. I have had other restaurants with it and I feel comfortable that I can help you with driving more traffic from Google. So okay. tell me a little bit how more customers you can handle each week. Yeah, so on a customer count or a, or a business volume percentage, I'd, I'd say we could look at a 20% increase and, and you know, that would probably amount to maybe, let's say, 100 customers a week, you know, an average value of, I don't know, 25 bucks. Okay, is that profit 25 or is that gross? That's gross, but, you know, so probably... You know, I don't have any fixed, you know, any overhead, additional overhead, just have the, the food and the labor, and the labor is about the same too. So it'd probably be at least 50% profit. So let's say 12.50 a week, additional profit. Okay, you are good in math, you know that? Uh, yeah. <laughs> so 12.50 per week is yep. $5,000 per month. Mm -hmm. So, Normally for an online store in Google Business Profile, I charge thousand dollar per month, but I'm not going to charge you that today. I feel I can do that for five hundred dollar per month and help you drive more traffic for Google. Does it work mm -hmm. for you? Well, yeah. How does that how does that online store work? Tell me more about that. So inside uh, Google, uh, you, you create an account and you can upload your menu and you can show when you're open you can show the price of it and they just can uh, go to your google business profile listing and and make some online ordering so they they will order actually on the google platform correct you can even mm -hmm. add your merchant account if you want but that's the next step but pizza is really what people looking online when they're hungry and it will drive a lot of traffic you know you want to make it easy uh, when they are hungry to find you right right and so having a store does that playing google's game does that rank me higher automatically yeah that is actually the beauty so if you add an online store you probably uh, pay a, a couple of percentage to Google, so they will automatically rank you higher. So it's hmm. a win-win situation for you, but also for Google. Yeah. Okay. 
So and and, and so you would you would manage that store for me and set it all yeah, up. Correct. I will do. I will set it up. I manage for you, uh, and yeah. you can just focus on your business. Yep, that's probably smart. Okay. So when would you like me to start? Probably next week. You know, we'll get through the weekend, but you know, we're closed on uh, Sunday and Monday, so probably Monday we can just go ahead and roll it out. Correct. Yeah, it's not that I can press on a button. I need to set it up, of course. Sure. So, yeah. Okay. Well, we better give us, you know, Monday we can visit about it. And, uh, okay. Get a strategy Sounds together. Good. Okay. Which card do you want to use? Oh, I want to use Amex because I want those miles. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I, I already said you are smart. So good. Yep. Okay. So what do you think? How did it go? How did it went? But, you know, I mean, Okay, from your experience, is that reality, or do you get more pushback? I don't get many pushback, but that's the way how I talk. And not everybody can talk like me, I think, because I I I let you know what you like to hear, mm. correct? Right. And and the second thing is, I know my stuff. I know my stuff very well. So yep. I know what works and what doesn't work. So every question you have. I kind of can answer. Yeah. So yep. do, does it always go easy? No, I think I get 80% of the, I get the credit card within five minutes. Yeah. Hmm. Because why every business owner understands ROI and everybody, every business owner understands ROI and I can convince them that I can help them. Yeah. So there's a real story from two weeks ago. So I, I got somebody to inspect my for the solar system for my house. And I ended up with a thousand dollar per month client. And just they asked me what 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 is your job? I say help a local business like you to find my customers. And they say uh, and the, the thing you said, can you help me too? Yes, I can help you. So and, and I, I did the same thing. When can you have more business as soon as possible? Okay, what's your card? I did the same thing. And my wife hated when hmm. I do this because she doesn't want me to have more customers. <laughs> but I, I, I do this since <laughs> I do this since 2009. I, when I had right. not a lot of customers, I did that all the time. So, but that always yeah. works. Yeah. So but, from a from a provider's from your provider standpoint, how long are you going to spend, or you know, what's your overhead in making this all happen? Yeah, I have a team. My team does it. Uh, well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, yeah. I, I I I don't do Google My Business. I don't do it's too the much work. The luxury of having a team. <laughs> I, I don't, well, it's okay. too much work. I I like my Google Ads. That's oh, okay. the, so, but. I will get them in Google Ads once I'm having Google My Business. Because they always say after three months, hey, Jack, how can I get more business? I yeah. said, yeah, then we have to start paid traffic. So yeah. then they, I, I have the trust. They see results. And they see results. And they want more results. Yeah, yeah. it's very, it flows very natural. Okay. Yeah. That's well, what I practice, feel, yeah. practice helps, you know, just being able to answer. No, no, I, I think you, when I hear you speaking, you don't need a lot of practice. You you are well spoken huh? and you uh -huh. are, you are, you're good with numbers. You know exactly how uh, if you make a proposal, if that works for you. Right. You were not uh, in, in at, at school. You were one of the best in math, I feel. <laughs> you Maybe so. Exactly yeah. You know exactly what to say. All right. Okay. Well, that helps. Good. Okay. Yeah. Just grab the phone and and the phone and ask if they like my business. That's how it works. That's the business. Right. Do you like my business? Do you want me to help? I I know how to help you. Mm -hmm. Well, and the and the big thing is is getting them to put a number on what that business is worth. Because if they'll admit to you, like I did, hey, this is worth, you know, 5000 a month. 
So what, you know, what's 500 to get 5,000? That's a no-brainer. Correct. And I make it a no-brainer. Yeah. So what I did is I I tell them the regular price, but it always double, something like that. Mm. Yeah. Or at least higher. And I said, if you decide now, I will give you a discount. Mm-hmm. And maybe I don't need to give a discount, but I feel uh, I feel for Google Business Profile, five hundred dollar is a good value. But for Google Ads, I like to get thousand dollar. The Google Ads, and I like to get five thousand dollar nowadays. I, I I didn't do that in the past, but now I I try to get thousand dollar per month. I do I will do it for less, but I try to get thousand dollar. Okay. Okay, very good. Okay, good. Okay, Jack, thank you. You're welcome. Okay, Patty, do you also want? Okay, let me try to mute you. Can you hear me? Yeah, I hear you. Hi, Jack. How are uh, you? I'm very good. How are you? Is it time? I think uh, two years ago I saw you, or not? Um, I think so. You, I, we were at uh, at at uh, Peachtree City in in, in Georgia. Like yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I still and remember I, that's, you. That's that's the last conference I've been out for. <laughs> Me too. Then COVID, yeah, COVID hit the next month, so yeah, yeah that was yeah. a nice conference, though. Yeah, so, I like. I do have a, a client that's interested um, in getting help with Google, but I haven't been confident enough to call her back yet because I'm not sure about she, what she's looking for is, so this is a woman who owns a state farm agency. And so they don't, I won't be able to like do a website for them or whatever, but they have a Google, they want to on Google get lots of reviews. And I don't, they said they had trouble with, they put reviews up, including I did one, and it never went up because Google called that foul. They said, no, there's too many or something like that. So I, I don't I don't quite understand Google reviews and I don't want to make any promises to them about what can happen. Okay, I will solve it for you. Okay. Who of your guys on this training is specialist in Google reviews? I, 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 I can do the basic, I will, I, I, I can do uh, getting reviews, but the thing is, I, 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 it takes some effort to get in contact with Google, but you can come in contact with Google. But what I probably would do is, mm -hmm. I would just call Google and, and explain the situation. That is probably what I would do. Okay. It takes effort, but I have a good number for Google Ads, and maybe if you call that number, you can ask the number for Google Business Profile. And I think if you if you lo log in in Google Business Profile listing, there is a support link. But in okay. Each, in each Google Business Profile listing, you can send a support link, but. Uh, because it's a free listing, they're not really responsive. But you have to Google it and find out that somebody probably in the Facebook group can help you with a good phone number. And you can email me and I have a phone number for Google Ads. And probably they will give you the phone number for Google Business Profile. So that is probably okay. how I would solve it. Okay. And and you have don't you have a product for getting reviews or getting testimonials? Yeah. Would that be any help at all? Yeah, but that is not the problem at the moment, correct? The problem yeah, is that they get they get not they get not accepted. I right. do have, but go, getting reviews is simple. You just ask for it, and you create a form. You create a form. What what you create a form? What explains the step how to leave a review and you give the form to each customer you email right. that form to each customer and also each google my business listing has a short link and you email that to each customer and 
so you just have to be active active okay. to ask for reviews that is the whole that is the best way to get reviews do not do not use a third party for fake reviews right just just so i don't know the, what which service was it which service did he had I uh, the service. they're a state farm agency insurance they, insurance okay so, so I, I feel, I feel each time when they sign up a new client, they can send them a an, uh, an link, an email, a request for review. Okay. So, and there, and are, there are even applications that you ask for the review and you, you rate them. And if you know have the good rating, you let them post. If you don't have a good rating, then it gets sent to the business and they can learn from it. But I That's feel if they, you know, the state farm when they have closed the deal, everybody is kind of willing to give a review, at least many of them. And you don't need 200 reviews. It's good, but 50 is enough. You know, it's not that. You need 200 all the time. 50, 10, you should have at least 10 to get the stars. 50 mm -hmm. is good. You don't need 200. Okay. But you want I, five stars. <laughs> yeah. I, I did learn because I have, I have an Etsy store and I did learn how easy it is to get reviews if you tell people what to say. So not that you put words in their mouth, but I ask them, can you tell me, did you like your customer service? Was it shipped on time? Do you like the quality? Those are the things I get graded on. So that's what I want them to talk about. And if you tell them what to talk about, they're more apt to give you a review. Because it's otherwise it's that getting a you know a blank piece of paper in front of you and no nobody knows what to do with it. They don't know what to yeah. say. I, so. I, I, I was very active in the past with this for my own business. Mm -hmm. So I sold this business, but so I sold this business. We see 150 reviews. Mm -hmm. So I, I I did that all in the past. I don't do that anymore, but mm -hmm. I, I, I did I did it all in the past and I give people instructions how to post reviews. Got it. So I, I did it. I know. So and I, I, I if I search on my computer i probably can find i had such document created uh, i have to i have to dig deep because i i'm not really into it so much more because i don't have my own local business mm -hmm. but you see this picture here yes yeah. so this picture i had is as uh this i had this business and he left us now okay uh, and i did that window they still have that. Mm -hmm. So, uh, so I learned all my my online marketing because I had that business, and I got all those reviews and rank high, and I, I, that that's when I really learned Google Ads and Google My Business. And can I ask you? Um, I'm part of uh, Jeannie's group, and she offers to do a post every day on Google. Yeah, how, you can do that. How that? How does that? How do you think that impacts Google placement? A lot, yes. but that will help a lot. But yeah, but you have to like so the the, the to post the post is not the problem to to come up with content. Right now you have to write something every day. Now I'm not. I, it's not my skill set to be social and Facebook and everything. It's not my thing. Right now we have to, so I, I I don't do a lot of social work because now I have to. Well, yeah, I feel who's interested in me. That's what I feel. Huh? Well, Je Jeannie's uh, posts are, are pre-done. You buy. Yeah, like but those, I don't think, I don't know if they, for Google business listing. So they are more for Facebook, but, and there are more images. Images with a, with wording in it, but it can, and it can be most anything, you know, a day in the, uh, what, what yeah. happened in, day in history or a quote that makes sense or something about health or whatever. So most she. things works. Yeah. Posting okay. work for ranking. Okay. But, Great. 
Jeez. And that shows that your Google listing is active because you're posting on there frequently. And then I just have to figure out the review thing. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking that they either were coming from a bad IP address or they had too many in one day or something like that. So I don't know if what the restrictions are, but um, I'm going to help them work it out so that they can get reviews on their Google page. Good. Are you already get paid for it? Not yet, but I will. But I, I mean, okay. I, I will, I will uh, do it for pay. I'm not going to do it for free. But I, I would like so to. What is, what is your strategy to get paid? Well, I'm going to um, offer to uh, do the posting for them, both on their Facebook page and on their Google page, and then th to optimize their Google page for them, and then charge them uh, a, a $97 a month. Yeah, yeah. Is that too cheap? So maybe you you split it up a little bit. I would probably do so. You do the social posting and you do also helping with reviews, correct? Right. And do you do another thing than those two? Well, I mean, I could build the website, but they they're state uh, farm. No, 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 they're but no, no, not the website. So separate to Google Business, those two. Yes. So I so I would I would quote them for both. No, each. I mean, so for the posting, I would quote them, and for the reviews, I would post them. Okay. And then let's say ninety-seven dollar each, but I still feel that it's not much, but. The posting is automated. That is why you only charge ninety-seven dollars. That is why you come up with that right. number. Right. It cost me nineteen. Yeah. Uh, a month, and then I charge them ninety-seven. So here's the thing. You have to think of what is worth to them instead of how much it costs to you. Okay. So. $97 is money, okay, and don't get me wrong, and if you have uh, 100 clients, it's $10,000, but if they are willing to pay 297 or 197 you know, you need, you need only 50 clients. Huh? Mm, so yeah. you have to think a little bit, you have to, if they are a real big insurance company, then how much is it worth to them? Right. So I probably, if I'm a big company, I probably would feel if you only charge $97, I probably would feel you are not professional. That is probably my feeling. So who's doing now for $97 something? That's, That's not, true. You know, it, but, but what do you get for $97, which helps your business a lot? It's, 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 we are also live in other times. So, uh, so I probably would charge 197 for the posting and 197 dollars for the online reviews. That's probably, and then see if they accept it or not. I'm not saying I would not do for 97 dollars, but I would not start with probably. I would start with 197 for each service and then see how that conversation goes. Okay. And let's say they say no, there's a lot of money. And then I probably would say, I understand. You know, you you haven't uh, seen any result for me, and I I really want to help you with it because it's my specialty. I'm willing to do three months for ninety seven dollar each, and then you see what I'm able to do, and then the regular price one ninety seven dollar kicks in. How how does that sound? That makes sense. That makes a lot. See, see, you 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 just work around it, huh? So, right, but if right. you already start now, it's very hard to earn more or uh, ask more later on. Right. So, I would not start too low with. I feel ninety-seven dollars for a big company is nothing. So it's not like the company would just start it and don't break even. They have money. They really have money, those insurance companies. And reviews matters, and Google My Business Listing matters to them. 
Okay. So, so you should get paid according your results and not if you only pay $90. That doesn't matter so much. So it's good that you only pay $90, but it should not be the the should not be the the factor how much you're going to earn from it because m maybe you have no cost you just hire somebody and pay ten dollar per month or whatever huh? it's not their business they they need to see that every day or whatever what you promise you get the post so what about doing uh two weeks for free and then a hundred no 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 uh, free okay Free, don't never, never, never do something for free. Okay. okay. I know you get brainstormed by other gurus, which say you have to do for free, but don't do it. Okay. Okay. You have, you have no. Why would you do something for free if you are good? Did you ever go to a specialist or doctor, and they did something for free for you? <laughs> no. No. And no. If they would, do, if they would do something for free, what would you think? No, you I'm not here. <laughs> so they are not short on money, okay? It's not your friend, your family member. They are not short on money. So you can give a discount and whatever to prove your service, but don't, don't do things for free. It may, no, no. Okay. So okay. Get rid, get rid of that free is good. I know other markets tell you that, but that's not not the case i they okay. those marks would tell you that is the you can already hear they have they have never had clients or almost no client by themselves they don't know how to talk business language got it so never for free you can give them a discount or for a while to get the results to get the deal uh, then if they really if to get to if they really want Okay. I don't. I I I try so, so make it me difficult. Okay, make it me difficult. So I ask you one ninety seven. I make me difficult. Hi Patty. Uh, yeah. So I can help you with that. Um, so the posting is only one ninety seven, and help your reviews is also one ninety seven. What What do you think? Well, one ninety seven. That's uh. That, that's kind of a lot of money. What What does that get me? So. Actually, 80% of all all people who look online, they use Google Maps to find an insurance company like you. If you you don't rank high above your competitors, if you don't have good reviews, they will not they will not sh show you. So, if you only get one one client per day extra, what does it work? How does it work out for you? It would be great to have more customers and and to make more sales and to get more reviews especially i'm very interested in the reviews so is your 197 going to get me reviews yes so i know you had a problem in the past i will help you to solve this i will help you to get a contact with google and then once it's all straightened out we will uh, i will help you to get even more reviews but on an organized way so now I, I think something went wrong in the past. We will we will sort it out and get you on the straight path. So when would you like to have more reviews? So if if it's 197 and you get my account all set up, why do I have to keep paying 197 every month? Because Google listing is dynamic. If you don't maintain it, the other business they they keep updating, they keep posting, they keep adding reviews. At a certain point. Your business is again on page number two, and you lose all those customers. So it would drop. If what what would you be doing every month for me that 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 I couldn't do for myself? Once you get my my account all set up, I will post for you daily, and I will help you get reviews every month. Okay, and are you guaranteeing how many reviews you're going to get for me? Google is cannot guarantee but what i'm willing to do is we can reassign in three months from now and see how things work out and after three months you just can cancel but i'm i feel pretty certain you will not cancel because you can just focus on your insurance company 
and I can ha I can focus on your helping marketing your business online. Oh, so these first three months, I'm not going to have any pro anything to show for my listing. It, it won't go to the first page for three months. Is that what you mean? I mean, it takes time to get your account sorted out. I need to work every day for the next three months on your account to get your posting in place, to get your review, reviews fixed, and whatever it takes, I will get your listing higher. So it takes some time and effort. Okay, so I'll be paying you the 197 and then it, in three months, are you going to tell me that the price goes up? No, no, no. We can lock it in. If you decide today, I'm willing to give you a yearly contract, okay? You only pay $197 for the posting and $197 for the reviews if you decide today. So when would you like me to start? Well, I need you to start right away. So I guess I'll have to give you the credit card number after all, Jack. Okay. So you you did well to make it be difficult, but you see yeah. how you can Found it. work around it. Huh? You, you're smart enough to say the yeah. same things that are, like I, I say. Yeah, got it. So, Thank you, Jack. Okay, good. Let me know, okay, how that worked I, out. I will. Okay, thank you. Bye. Bye. So this actually helped me to uh, <laughs> to speak with, to, to get you that uh, client training. No, but we didn't get time today. Actually, we already are an hour, hour on the way. I created an audit forum and I, uh, I think this is another way to 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 show that they have problems with the business listing i just created today we don't need to go into detail probably uh, we can discuss another time but that was that was uh, actually a topic what we could discuss but we will do it another time if like Patty or whatever is very good in client getting, but you don't like to do the work. Don't worry, okay? Get a credit card, go to Jack Hopman and go to Done For You. Then our team can do the Google Business Profile and our team can do the Google Ads Management. So you take the money and we do the work. And with that said, I really thank you for, guys for your time and I love to see you on the next training. Thank you so much.